Hey folks, what's crappin'? It is Troy here, aka Ditryin, and I'm gonna try to finish off, uh, it's 1.30 in the morning, by the way. I'm gonna try to finish off, uh, episode 3 of The Wolf Among Us. Let's just get into it. Big B! I just got here. Yeah, me too. It's number 23. I haven't seen it yet. We're late. Yeah, I know. Alright, we're running out this of time. Is it. All right. How do you want to do this? 14 minutes late. Hello. Hi. You woke me up. Uh, sorry about that. Is something wrong? Who are you? Rachel, who are you? Just so we're not strangers. Well, I'm the sheriff, and this is my partner. Boss. Pleased to meet you. How do you do? Is there, um, is there anything you need? Is Auntie Greenleaf at home? Does she live here? You mean my mom? She ever, you know, make the nightstand levitate, turn frogs into cats, that kind of thing? Is she a witch, dear? No, I would never call my mommy that. She treats me all right. Is there something you want? I don't think I can really help you. Snow, can you just do something here? I, I never have any idea what to say to these people. You mean children? Do you mind if my friend here takes a look around? I promise we'll be quick so you can hurry back to bed. That is something Snow White's good with. Is I've been here all kids. night. Nobody's been here. Okay, boss. I'm gonna trust your friend not to break anything. Okay, boss. Don't get me in trouble. Look for anything unusual. Yeah, like Crane. Her whole still be here. Her whole tone changed there. That your mom? Uh huh. Let me guess. Big band or classical? Honky tonk. No accounting for taste. Your mom a hunter? Oh no, she never... That was found in the woods around Dick's Mountain, I think. Dick's Mountain? It's pretty rare to see a burner like this. <sighs> Dowdy. That's how we like it. That's a nice tree. What is this? Mommy uses that to carve her trinkets. It's from the old world. Trinkets? Um, like glamours? Some sort of enchanted tree. Probably. You're not here. There's no one here but me. No one's been over all night, so... He's just going to check. It'll only take a moment. Nothing that looks like Crane was here either. Nothing? See? Where do you buy your... The butcher. The butcher. What's that? A package having to do with someone called the butcher. It's empty. God damn it. I shouldn't say that. Nothing. I keep getting whiffs of that aftershave of his. I do too. Can I go to bed now, please? No. Is that a glamour tube? Mommy really doesn't let anyone play with that. Trust me, I've tried. Oh, no, 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 
please, 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 just put that back exactly where you found it. No one is allowed to play with it's that. It's all right, honey. Bigby's not going to break no, it. You don't understand. She will freak out if she discovers I've let people in here and let them touch her stuff, okay? She checks all the time to see if things move. I don't want to get in trouble. Look, I'm already grounded. Snow, come on. Are you kidding? It's a glamour tube. Something's going on here. No! Put it down! Please, don't! This isn't what you think! You gotta believe me! That guy isn't here, I promise! It's gonna be okay, Rachel. Please, I'm begging you. I don't wanna... I don't wanna get in trouble. What? You picked the wrong night to lie to me. No more lying, no more ring around the rosy, no more bullshit nonsense. Now skip to the You're point. Done. It's over. You're gonna tell me what I want to know right now. All right, start explaining. And from the beginning. I was born in the woods to a jackal and a deer. Not that. Where's Crane? Speak quickly. I ain't a fortune teller, wolf. I have no heavenly idea where he went to. You have to know something. Unless you want a recipe for owl stew, there's nothing I know that would help. Just why in the name of everything holy are you protecting this weaselly scumbag? I mean, what on earth could he have done to deserve this kind of loyalty? Crane could be hollow bones tomorrow, and you wouldn't see me cry a drop. But that doesn't mean I can tell you anything. You have friends, don't you? Well, I don't want Crane's friends for enemies. If you're not protecting Crane, who are you protecting? Get this through both of your skulls. I can't tell you. Just you being here is bad enough. There's powers at work here beyond your pathetic authority. Whatever it is, Greenleaf, whatever it is that's keeping you from saying something, you have to forget it. This is more important. I don't give a shit about your problems, Greenleaf. Just talk, now. You have no idea what's going on, do you? Okay, you know what I think? I think we've been more than patient with you. This witch has been selling illegal glamours that continue to undermine everything we've built. She's harboring a fugitive that took advantage of it, and now she's resisting every attempt to make things right. I frankly don't give a crap if she's afraid for her life. We can at least make sure she never hurts us again. Yeah. We're destroying the tree. No! What? How dare you come in here and threaten to take from me the one thing that... That tree is ancient. It's part of the family, and it's the only thing paying for this shithole apartment. And the fables who can't afford the glamours from you come to me for help. Without them, where do you think they could go? Don't give me that. You're making hmm. money off of other people's misery. Okay, Snow Whites are dead because of this crap. It's too dangerous leaving this stuff with her. You think I like being the old woman in these stories? The men are heroes, the ladies are whores, and the old hags like me get to watch everyone they love die. We have very different ways of handling our fate. Very different means to handle it, too. And I don't use it as an excuse to wreck people's lives. I'm sorry, Sheriff, but please, don't do this. Greenleaf Snow's right. The tree has to go. No! Look, look, I'll tell you, I'll tell you. Crane was here. He was here, and he left. He went to the pudding and pie to try to use my ring on the girls over there to get information. What does the ring do? He thinks it's the ring of dispel. You know, that it will pierce the protection around the girls' speech. He says pulling the truth out of them will prove his innocence. It won't, though. Damn thing lost its power decades ago. Just please, you can catch him if you leave, okay? Just leave, and don't... Don't burn my tree. I'm begging you. I'm begging you. Don't destroy it, please. Orders are orders. That might have been... dickish. But doomed me. Do you know that? 
hurt having this tree that could I told you everything. make this and shit. you extinguish the only measure I have in this horrid world. What monsters are you? It was what leading to like... evil, villainous, dwarfed monsters are you? The tree's nothing. spells... Nothing. You took everything from me. I have nothing. Were leading to murders and covering up murders. So... Fucker, I don't feel bad about it. Oh, now we're at the put in a pie. That's Crane's car. No, it's nothing you need to concern yourself with. I don't think so, at least. Shit. This guy's oh, back on his, oh, like, car Mr. phone Scott. from the 80s. Mr. Clean, come to smash up the rest of my place. Oh, I see. Come to audition, you bitch. Where's Crane? Ichabod Crane? What would that nerd have with a place like this? Tell me what you know now! Hey, you can't just go in there. We have a problem. Tell me who did it. Just tell me who did it. I know you know. Mr. Crane, please. She can't help. I know you know what the plan is. I won't be held accountable for this. I can't. I can't. I'm sorry. I... Oh, my God. Big B. Wait, don't. I, I, I didn't do anything. I promise you, I didn't do anything. These girls. The girls, they'll back me up. I just have to get this stupid ring working, that's all. They can't talk because of that spell. But once this ring gets through, I'll know what's going on and this whole thing will be over. That's all. Please. I'm innocent. Completely, completely innocent. The ring won't work. Greenleaf sold you out. What? No. This will work. I assure you, it, it must. I, I went to you. Like he's the pervert. Please tell me who killed her. My lips are sealed. Mm. <laughs> How many years? What? How many years has this been going on? Two. Too many. But I didn't kill those women, Bigby. Please, I had nothing, nothing to do with that. I just, I, it just, oh God. We found the photos of you and Lily. I know, I know, that's, that was, I just, I just love you, Snow. I love, I love you, and, and I'm sorry I'm not Prince Charming, okay? I'm sorry I didn't cheat on you. He's some away fucking from incel. You don't love me, Crane. I know what this is. I've seen it before. It is not love. It isn't love, or he just wants to fuck her. Bigby? I don't think he did it. What? Look at him. Do you really think this I don't think so either. these women? He's not... He wouldn't be brave enough not to put his stamp on the world like that. We've been chasing this guy. Just... Why now? Because look at him. You said you found evidence of him defrauding Fabletown, of using our money for his own... ambitions. That's one thing. But don't you have doubts he's a murderer? We've both known him for so long. I can't believe I'm hearing this. Did you see how he was acting when you showed up? Yes, I know how this... Why would he even come here if he wasn't covering his tracks? This fuck-up knows more than he's saying. I don't. I don't! Uh, yes, okay, he probably does. But there's a difference between being involved and being the guy who did it. She's right. Okay, but if Crane didn't kill Faith and Lily, I'm sorry, but who the hell did? You know, when I saw you come back here... This whole thing is bigger than Crane. He wouldn't have the stones to send the Tweedles after me. Somebody else is involved. Well, shit. 
the crooked man. You've been stealing money from Fable Town for years, haven't you? Yeah. We're not gonna kill you, so quit your shivering. Ichabod Crane, you are under arrest for the misappropriation of Fable Town funds. You have the right to counsel, the right to depose witnesses, but as of right now, you're coming with us. Get the fuck up. Now. I guess we know who's in charge, Sheriff. It's not about who's in charge, it's about doing your job. Oh, is it? You think you have what it takes to run that office? You think I didn't make sacrifices? I made sacrifices. And you won't be in that chair one minute before you have to give up something you care about just so the wheels don't fall off the goddamn wagon. I did the best I could with what I had. And the town took everything it could out of me. If I maybe took a little something back in return, so be it. Better save your energy, huh? You're going away for a long time. Now, who is the thing? Not done yet. Oh, that's some loud thunder. Oh, okay. Stupid girls and the imposter schemes. What are you saying? I'm gonna get drive by. Is that like a Toyota MR2? That's what it looks like. The Tweedles? Who's that? What you got there? Who's that? Look, it's recently come under our attention that you're, how shall I put this, attempting to claim what is the personal property of the Crooked Man. He's about yay high, 120 odd pounds, pissed his sheets until he was 14. Sound familiar? I haven't told him anything. Not now, not now. Shh. The grown-ups are talking. Who are you? No, 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 no. That's not how this works. How this works is you are going to walk Crane over here like a good doggy. It wasn't my fault. <clears throat> Shut up. You're interfering. Now with she's the punching people in the gut. Business. Step aside. Tweedledee. What's the uh you know, that thing the Mundies call me? What? what? My nickname. You know what I'm talking about. Uh, Bloody, Bloody Ma Mary. That's it. Thank you. And do you know why they call me that? Because some of them, they think it's funny to have their little sleepovers and go into their little bathrooms and say my name five times in the mirror. They find it less funny when I actually show up and feed their lungs to the family dog. And I do that for a hobby. Like golf. To relax. This is my job. I like my job. This was really the wrong day to try and pull this shit. I told you he'd never just give him up. Fuck it. What? What? I pressed left. Oh, 
Bigby? Mm. I got plot armor. I just tells me to keep on W. Oh shit! There's so many things I could have picked, and I didn't pick any. I don't want to kill the guy. Oh, she's got a... I got a special silver bullet. It was a good show, but you know, it just didn't know when to end. Oh, the woodsman axe? You know, you wouldn't think silver bullets would work on anything but a pure werewolf, but as it turns out, it's just a big Right, Wolfie? I mean, hey, look, I know it sounds ridiculous, but really. It's completely based on <laughs> Can you argue what the story the needs, results? I guess. Because I know I can't. Wait! Stop! Just take him, okay? Take Crane. Just stop, please. Hmm. Yeah, I don't know. Snow, don't do this. That's the crooked man. It's your lucky day, kid. Crooked Man says it's okay with him. Crooked Man is Daniel Day Lewis from. Hello, Ichabod. Got a The show back. with the oil drilling. That movie. That I can't remember. Remember the name of? I drink your milkshake. I drink it up. You know what I'm talking about. Oh, and just between us girls? Crane ain't no kid. I mean, look at his face. Couldn't stick a pig if his life depended. Kinda like your boyfriend here. Too pussy to ruin a tweet's day. Well, this is gonna be a beautiful relationship we have with you guys. Really, I mean it. I'm jazzed about it. Out with the old, in with the new. I'm kind of surprised 
Snow White stayed so chill after she I'm broke sure her arm there. Touch. See you around. That's got to be the end of episode three. Eh? Okay, yeah. Yeah, Snow White stayed surprisingly chill considering they just broke our arm. He's lucky to be alive. And he won't be next time if he keeps going like this. This is getting worse by the minute. We don't have time to sit around and wait for their next move. I'll get things under control. Woody? I'm not gonna tell you again. Back off, dog. This doesn't concern you. What do you want to talk about? I just wanted to, um, about last night. After what they did to you, are you even gonna be able to stop them? Don't and bloody Mary out of Jack. nowhere there. You've always got some angle. Not this time. I know when a mark's not worth the trouble. Do you? Don't make me come down there to deal with you. I don't want Colin. To haven't heard from him in a while. Fucking toad. <laughs> then again, you don't have much choice at this point, do you? Did you interrupt Snow's eulogy? Uh, most people didn't do that. Okay, that seems about right. What place did you investigate first? Well, I picked the most popular one. Oh. Did you offer Flycatcher a job? Everyone did? Okay. Did you burn Greenleaf's tree? Only 20% did that. Oh, that kind of surprised me. Did you kill Tweedledum? 55% showed mercy. Okay. Alright guys, thanks for watching me play through the first three episodes of Season 1 of The Wolf Among Us. Man, I'm really digging this game. Um, I knew it'd be too long to play in a single night, but it is like fucking... What time is it? It's currently 2 in the morning. I'm exhausted. Thankfully, I'm... Yeah, anyways. So much fun. Uh, it's getting really interesting now. Uh, we got two more episodes to play through. I hope to do that. I might even do that tomorrow. I don't know. I'll see what happens. But anyways, peace out. Keep, keep it real. See you motherfuckers around. Bye.